Thank you very much for this kind introduction. And uh, thanks to the organizers for giving me the opportunity to tell you uh, what we are doing around clouds, but not only about clouds, uh, at CERN. So uh, as you have heard, uh, I'm not a um, computer scientist. I've never done research in computer science, but I'm interested in this kind of stuff more from a user perspective and from a deployment perspective. And uh, as you will see, uh, this at a relatively large scale. So this presentation is about agile infrastructure at CERN, uh, or put it another way, moving 9,000 servers into a private cloud. And just to rectify this uh, possibly false perception, this is not about starting to move 9,000 9, servers now and being done after the 45 minutes of this presentation. We are not quite that ambitious. So first of all, uh, let me, uh, for those of you who uh, may not be entirely familiar with it, explain to you what CERN is. Uh, if you come to CERN, you see this uh, pile of uh, flags. <coughs> uh, this is an emblematic building, our globe of innovation. Uh, CERN is an international organization close to Geneva. It straddles the uh, Swiss-French border and was founded already in 19. 54. And many people take this just as a number, but just be aware that uh, this is only nine years after the end of World War II, and one year before the Roman treaties were signed, which laid the foundation to what is now the European Union. And in 1954, it was the first, I think it was the first, at least one of the first, uh, European uh, collaborations across countries who had been in war in, uh, just nine years before that. Um, <coughs> the mandate of the lab is to provide facilities for fundamental research in particle physics. So all these words are important. We do particle physics, we don't do nuclear physics. We do fundamental research, we don't do applied research financed by industry, and it is not about doing this research itself. The lab is there in order to provide the facilities. Um, so we have currently 21 member states, mostly from Europe, but recently Israel was admitted as a member state, and uh, this can't really be considered European anymore. And the membership is now open to non-European uh, countries. The budget is in, of the order of uh, 1 billion Swiss francs per year. Uh, we have on the CERN payroll some 3,360 people, staff, fellows, students, and apprentices, and so on. And all these people contribute to providing facilities. And we provide the facilities to a total of 11,000 users coming from many countries.